How's gold performing in Zimbabwe? Gold performance is universal. universal. Always high. Yeah. It's right a universal high. commodity. I bought so much gold during zero interest rate phenomenon and I lost so much money. But gold prices always go down when interest rates go up. I know, but I didn't understand anything. No. Yeah. That but right now they're about $2,000. So yeah. your Zimbabwe even... So if you want physical, generally in most countries across the world, there's a premium. In Zimbabwe, because of inflation, that premium is probably higher. You told me something last time we met. I don't know if you remember, but you said something along the lines of if you have extra liquidity, invest in sovereign... Something gold. you said. Sovereign, sovereign gold. gold bonds. You get like a 2.5% kicker. So basic problem is we don't have any gold. Okay, India. We consume a lot of gold. I think... Consume in what way? Import. So when, say, my mother buys jewelry, if she buys a gold chain, that gold did not come from here, right? It goes to different pockets of the world. It typically comes from Switzerland, Dubai, wherever we import yeah. it. Each time we import it, it's a deficit item for the country because we are getting foreign currency to buy that gold. To negate this, so I think the number was... 500 billion, something like half a trillion was the amount of gold we had imported in the last couple of years. And to negate this, the government said, we will start gold bonds to add outside of the price of gold, which you will get the fluctuations and the increments. We will give you an additional two and a half percent if you invest in SGB. Got it. To negate the impact on the fiscal deficit that we are having. But it's a pity that we don't have gold because... Traditionally, we did. And I think given enough research and enough time, space to this, yeah. No, but right, right now... We're right next to the only gold mine we have. KGF, right? KGF. Columbia but right now, a lot of central banks across the world, from China to Russia to all of these guys are starting to hoard gold, yeah. which is a very interesting trend. And generally, following the smart money is a good idea. And smart money is big money. And central banks are the biggest of them all. Hi, I'm Nikhil Kamath. I'd love to know what you thought of the episode. Uh, comment, like and subscribe. And thank you for watching.